We do have a um, animals available for foster gallery on our website. So anyone who's interested in fostering can take a look at the animals there and they're welcome to reach out to me. If they see one that is a good fit. A lot of people tend to say that um, they are concerned that maybe when they bring the animal back, that the animal's going to be sad that they're coming back um, and they kind of feel a little bit guilty about doing that. Um, and I try to always tell people that they shouldn't feel badly at all. Um, it's, it's much better than spending, you know, time here in the shelter. Um, and it really does help with decreasing stress levels. So um, by taking an animal out of here, you're protecting them against, you know, any potential contagious illness spread. Um, you're, you're helping advertise them. Um, and then you're also helping um, them just decompress and, and be less stressed. So um, never feel guilty about, you know, if you only foster for a weekend, having to bring the animal back because it's only beneficial. The shelter provides all medical care. So we cover everything from um, emergency vet services to vaccines, preventatives, um, and then all of our animals are um, given their, their first initial intakes and kept up to date on shots while they're with us. We also try to provide all the supplies. Um, that includes for our large dogs, crates, um, beds, toys, bowls. Um, for our neonatal kittens, we have bottles already. We have uh, syringes. We've got formula. So I really do try to make it super easy for people to just walk in, grab, and then have everything already so you don't have to go to the pet store and spend a lot of money to take a foster home.